Hi there, this is Dan from 123Muse. Um, I'm going to show you in this video how to load up your Pro Slider unit um, if you are using an HTTPS site. So this is just uh, for an HTTPS site. Um, so the reason it won't um, work under normal circumstances is well, let's just pull the parts out that we need onto the page. I'm going to bring all the separate parts onto the page. Just line these up. <clears throat> and the reason this uh, won't work normally in HTTPS uh, sites is because it's pulling the runtimes um, just here um, from www.museengine.com. And this is an HTTP site that is pulling the uh, the running scripts. And so it's trying to pull unsecure scripts into a secure site, which obviously isn't going to work. Um, so there's a really straightforward way to get this to work. So what you're going to want to do is inside your, um, your pro unit script loader, you're going to open up that script loader. And uh, normally you wouldn't have to do this. Um, but open that up and here where it says um, add a file for a blank GIF, um, go to your um, slider one package and inside there you will have this pro units runtimes. Open that folder up, load up the blank GIF. Once that's done, click that that's added. Then runtime A is going to be this file here, runa.js and check that one and run b is going to be run b.js and check that one and the htc is going to be this pi.htc so check that one now and if you've used waypoints then you can add your waypoints file but if not you don't need to add that um, so once those are all um, checked out you're going to see here um, now that that this is We'll just zoom in on it. Um, this is all green and it's got a check mark inside there. And then there's one more thing that we're going to need to do is open up our main slider uh, section and in here in the setup, now where um, it says runtimes URL, you're just going to put your URL in there, whatever your website is. So https colon forward slash forward slash www.yourwebsite.com whatever it is, dot com, dot whatever. And what this is going to do is when you then publish this site, um, it's now going to upload all of these um, runtimes inside your own um, web server. Um, and, and because your web server is an HTTPS um, site, it's now going to be, um, when it calls these um, functions, it's now going to be calling them and they're going to be sitting inside an HTTPS environment so it'll be able to run them. So first of all, what we've done is we've added the files we needed to um, from the runtime folder and then we've gone in here and inside the setup, we changed this setup to uh, run times URL and we just changed this to our URL. And once you've done that and published it, then um, the slider is going to work. Okay, hope this helps, guys.